interrupt this recording to bring you the Glitches Get Stitches podcast. mentally wrong with him to become a serial murderer except the drive. I know for a fact I'd be dead long ago if it wasn't for his sheer laziness. If he was going to do it though, I think he'd invite me over for some mozzarella cheese sticks, Jaeger in some form, and then when I was least expecting it, feed me to his possessed unmade bed of death and I would get eaten by all the tormented souls trapped inside. It's Jeff. It would. It's been a long three weeks, but I know he definitely missed me. He's got a shine about him and a spring in his step that he didn't before. Or maybe Kelly touched his pee-pee, I don't know. But it's probably because <laughs> his birthday is coming up. It's Dukes. It was an eerie time in Tempe. As it was all Hallow's Eve, the dust storm was still strong, running rampant. And man was in the middle of playing his favorite game, <clears throat> Overwatch 2, when he got an uncomfortable ting on the back of his neck as his phone started to ring. A bolt of lightning struck outside the house. The man shook his head as he answered the phone. Hey, this is the owner of GGS. A voice returned. I have your Arby's and your rank. The man looked back at the screen. Unranked? The screen read. How? How can you do this? He said. The voice returned. <laughs> That's not all. The voice replied. Instantly it became dark. The only light left was on the man's cell phone. Beads of sweat dripping down the man's face. A voice led on the phone. My name, John. You're welcome. <laughs> That's right. Welcome back, Universe. Chat, if you're just getting in here, how you doing? How you doing? Uh, do us a favor, hit the like, hit the share, drop a comment. Welcome to episode 104 uh, the, of the 2GS show, Glitches Get Stitches podcast. Find us on Instagram, Twitter, Hover, TikTok, Discord, our home Facebook, and our partner Twitch. Where are we live on Twitter? Right now? We are not. We're not live on Twitch. So we gotta have you start trying that one soon with your stream. Yeah. See how that works. Alright, yeah. we should have had Jeff. But it's okay. It's alright. Twitch, we love you. We'll see you next time, motherfucker. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. And if you haven't already, shown the love. Please, show us all your love. And send those pictures to Jeff's inbox. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. He loves all the love. What up, Mugen? Ray! Uh, if you missed the live podcast or want to catch up on any episodes you missed for free, Fluoride Radio Network, iTunes, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, YouTube, for extra credit, please go there. And if you're watching the the um, uh, the movies and whatnot, the videos, do us a favor and hit that subscribe for free. It'll really help us out. We're on our way to a thousand. We need a thousand free subscribers before we can monetize our YouTube. Right now, we're at 300 and almost 400. I can't remember. 300 and something, something? Oh, almost 400. So we're doing good. We're doing good. It is hot in this mask. I'm not going to lie. It's October, but it doesn't feel like October. What's the weather over there, D Dakota? Uh, it's a little warmer today, but yesterday was perfect October weather. Was it like... <clears throat> what's per what To me, perfect October weather is like 50 degrees, 40 degrees. Perfect. Well, for here, well, it, it, was, it was like 65, so I could wear a sweatshirt. <laughs> it's never perfect here. Jeff, uh, it's... It's, it's nice it? out right now. Huh? It's nice out right now. I haven't been outside in eight days. Only to meet the Arby's man at the door. <laughs> and you just make him leave it and put it through the slot. Yep. Slide me the beast. Shove it through the, the little, slot. like, mail mail Yeah, the little mailbox <laughs> slot. <laughs> You're a mailbox slut. Oh, what? Uh, plan on getting anything from GameStop? Nope. All right. <laughs> if you do, though, check out our link. It'll take you there. You can order whatever. 
Um, and then we're still working on getting that going, but we're there. Um, if you have any uh, questions, just message me. I'll let you know. On today's new episode 104, we welcome each other back from a little break from the cast by hazing each other without remorse. We crack into some gaming news of the week and discuss Overwatch 2's huge failure at launch that tells us Blizzard will always never be ready for a game release, ever. And we sprinkle in some Holloway shizzle. So put on your... Uh, put on your favorite Look. mask and grab a hold tight. Let's go. It, that for some reason, it said put on your favorite GM's mask. And I was like... Uh-oh. Uh, put on the mask of Nick or... <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I have to murder you. I need your face for a mask. Put on your favorite mask. All right, there we go, there we go. All right, everybody, you know what time it is. GGS here. It's time for some shots or whatever you're drinking. Put it in your mouth or if you drink the water, hydrate. Put putting things in our mouth. I got to take. I got to do this, though. Oh, God, put the mask on. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God, put it back on. hurts. My eyes start bleeding. Just Raiders of the Lost Ark. Right. <laughs> Start melting. Jeff, what are you drinking? I am. I get vodka. Platinum. Uh, no, Kirkland. Oh. Uh, Dakota, are you still doing your a little hiatus? Or? Yep. Good old water. You doing that? Are you uh, doing that for a certain amount of time, or just till you your liver can breathe again? I'm doing it till I feel better. <laughs> That's my secret. I never feel better. I never feel better. <laughs> Cheers. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Oh. No, I went a little hard at a, at a, what is it? The Great Wolf Lodge, you know? And I came back and I was like, hey, hey. My liver was definitely mad at me. And I said, shut up, liver. I'm your leader. Punch it. Punch it right in the <laughs> <laughs> um, Alright, let's talk about a little, uh, like I said, this is just going to be the little crack sprinkling of Halloween, and then the next episode we'll do, we'll make it really Halloween themed and all the, all the stuff. Uh, but, uh, like I said, we're going to sprinkle some questions in for you guys in chat and for you boys in the house. What's your favorite horror lead in a movie, Jeff? Favorite horror? Yeah, let me know. My favorite horror. Your favorite Ooh. horror in a movie. Nev Campbell in yeah. Scream. <laughs> yeah. My, fa- my favorite. Is that, what? Is that slut Julia Roberts? Uh, <laughs> From Pretty Woman or whatever it is. What's what, what's the actual question again? <laughs> uh, favorite horror. Horror. In a movie. From a like, horror movie. Like, like, like villain or like protagonist? Anybody? Whoever you want. What gets Jeff going? Your favorite antagonist or uh, uh, Jigsaw. 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 Oh, Jigsaw. Nice. I just said Jason. <laughs> Jason. It's a very French version. Yeah. It's a Jason. I haven't seen that. Yet. Like Sir Platypus. His name is Jason. Jason. Yeah. Uh-huh. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, what about you? Uh, probably Pennywise. Uh, Pennywise. Good too. Nice. He's pretty dope. I'm gonna go with Freddy K. Also he, good. He, I feel like he sees a lot of titties more than anybody else. Yeah, because he sees them in the dreams. Exactly. He sees those teenager dreams. So, you know, wherever there's titties, I'm going to go. Or I'm going to try to be it. We know. <laughs> <laughs> All right. My name is Jeff. Yeah. That's, that's me. Uh, How are you doing, you Cali bound bitch boy? Uh, how are the waters to... on the sea of California? Terrible. Well, and the ox are important anyway. They are. You want to go to San Diego if you actually want to go to the beach. Right. Well, I know that's where I went. I remember because I was talking to you. I was like, "What if I went more north? You'd like you wouldn't be in the fucking water." Yeah. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's cold as ice. I mean, that water was mm-hmm. cold where I was. So I. Uh, yeah, it's I, even it's, it's even worse. The further up you go. Crazy, crazy. Mm-hmm. What about you, Ray Ray Mugen? Favorite horror? <laughs> no, it was horror. That was one mistake that we taught Sunny the word horror. She was, she would be like, "You're a whore." Oh, God damn it! <laughs> like, no horror. Let's just say scary. How about we just yeah, say scary? Just, yeah, say scary. Mm-hmm. Um, 
I got a question for you. While you were at the beaches in Cali, did you fuck the Sea Hulk? Oh, the, I am no, I am no Matt Murdock. I cannot pull that <laughs> off. I cannot. <clears throat> um, Dakota, are you? Did you watch this, uh, She Hulk at all? Nope. Yeah, can I just tell you something that happens? You can and explore the whole thing because I'm never ever gonna watch it. I didn't think. So. I didn't think. So. Um. So Daredevil bangs. Oh yeah. She Hulk. I know that. That's all over okay. Facebook. All right, all right, all right, yeah, yeah. So Daredevil has got all up in that green ass. Did he, even, did he didn't even know. How did he, oh, he you know. know. He's blind. He knows. He knows the heartbeat. Oh, yeah. He okay. knows. He feels that gr- big, large green ass. It's not Jeff's <laughs> fucking ass in his hand. It's <laughs> She-Hulk. Okay. <laughs> um, uh, you know, the show was all right. It wasn't terrible. It, it was like, it was literally, like I called it, a Sex in a City Marvel style show. And it was. It was. It had some, it had, but some good action. That's good action. I'm not saying it didn't. Um, did you like? Did you like it overall, Jeff? Yeah, yeah, I liked well, especially it. if they put Daredevil in, and you were all over it. You did. You loved it so much. Yeah, but I guess it's pretty. Like, I guess that's how the comics were too. It was just like the show was. So yeah, the fourth I, wall break. I feel like it's their, also their tiny, in intro into putting Deadpool in finally. Yeah, and like, the X Men. Like, Disney's she a whole lot of shit. <laughs> in the fourth wall. You know, uh, and Hulk has a son. Yeah. Stupid ass haircut. He does. With the stupidest fucking haircut. Why? Why do they have to bitch him up? Different Come planet. On. Are you going to complain about a different planet's hairstyle? I, I go would. there and start my own fucking hairstylist shop, and it's called Don't Be a Bitch Boy Haircut. And you come in, and I put a bowl around your head. <laughs> Well, he didn't have a father growing up, so you know, yeah. what do you, you do? You can't blame him. Mom man with supporter sticker. He had a, a mom that didn't know how to hook cut hair with a bowl either. I mean, well, or, I don't even know or, where was his mom. Or I don't even know. Pot. We know I, nothing. I, I think he fucked Val, Valkyrie. Not fucking Valkyrie. God damn. No? Jesus Christ. No, it's not Valkyrie. He, did he fuck some low level? Valkyrie's a lesbian, canonically, and in the movies, she's a lesbian. If I was a lesbian and Hulk was like. Let me smash. If I if it was one dick I was going to take in this lifetime, it would be the Hulk's. Just it would so I can say I had literally split you in half. You'd be dead. I can't wait. I'm going to be <laughs> There's, back. You can't, it's hard to give birth when you're dead. <laughs> John, your asshole is oh, already then. Up. Yeah. All right. So you just beat – what game did you just beat? Man of Ma- Madan? Man okay. of Madan. Yeah. Madan. Okay. I don't sound smart when I say it. Yeah. I mean, I was – Little hope. Let's finish that next. She is Annabelle. I was just being a Wiener Schnitzel. Or about because yeah, she's by, but I don't. No one's. I don't. It's got to be someone on Sakar because I don't think Hulk can bang a human in Hulk form and have yeah, them survive. Yeah. And he was Hulk the whole time there, pretty much. Yeah, up until Bruce Banner like, got there, about to leave. Yeah. Or not Bruce Banner. Uh, fucking uh, uh Thor. Yeah. Um, all right, what you got going on? Annabelle, how you doing? Welcome in, welcome in. Uh, what you got on the docket for spooky season? This game, I'm, I'm assuming you'll beat next stream if it's like the other one. Yeah, it's pretty quick. So probably. So what's next? Uh, actually, I might, um, I never actually beat Resident Evil 7, so. You never uh, beat Resident Evil 7. Oh, okay. Yeah, the one before, uh. Well, I guess they called it Biohazard or seven, yeah, yeah, yeah. whatever. Yeah, when you first play as Ethan, I never beat it. So I'll probably re-download that and That'll do it. Dope. That'll be real dope. I think the last person I saw play that was uh, Lydia, I think, on stream one. Oh, long, long day. that was, no, she did Village, right? Did she do Biohazard and Village? She did Biohazard and, I don't know if she did Village. I, don't I saw, know, her, but I, I saw I don't her do know. Village because that stupid part where it's like, in the beginning, you get to like a little hut or something. It's like yeah. looking out the window. And you look out oh, the window. Oh, yeah, and it scares the fuck out of you. Werewolf right there, yeah. You're looking for a number or something? Yeah, I watched her play that, that Dakota! part. Dakota! Hey! Hello? Hello? Dakota? Hello? Hello? Can you not hear me? Oh. <laughs> and now we can. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Um, 
How are you doing, buddy? <clears throat> doing all right. Awesome Phasmophobia stream with the game. Yeah, that was fun. awesome. Jeff was even, I couldn't fucking believe it. Jeff was in there. I was I at the, the tail end of it, yeah. It was good. It was good shit. Uh, are you going to be doing more of that this season? Or are you going to be switching up with some spooky games? What you got planned? Uh, I don't really have spooky games to, to play, so I'm probably going to just maybe play some Phasmophobia again. So, that's cool. That was uh, a lot of fun with you guys. It was a very fun stream to watch. And then how's Valor going? Good. Good. You said you're going to be playing that after this? Yeah. Uh, what's new about that? New season, new battle pass. Uh, there's a new agent. His name's Harbor. He uh, does a lot of cool water water craftsman shit. Oh, he's a water craftsman? Yeah, he has like this uh, artifact he wears on his hand that he can like send water in different ways. Like All of his abilities are all based water-based. Pretty cool. Could he... Could he uh... Uh, uh, bidet my anus after he, a shit. He could storm? actually. His ult is uh, he puts water in the ground and geysers go up, so everybody gets bidet. Oh that's on the oh. yeah. Tell that guy to come over to my house after you finish playing with him. Yeah. <laughs> so he can start playing with you. Yep. Exactly. Uh, all right, everybody. Not all at once. Asking me if I'm doing well. I'm doing very well. Thanks, everyone. Right, 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 right. Oh, they all died of not. Caring. <laughs> <laughs> I have been doing awesome. Overwatch 2 grind. It is real. And I've been doing it. Uh, got gold one. I'm trying for platinum, which I'm hoping will be my next set of seven games. Um, but we'll see because sometimes you don't get what you want in this. And it's okay. It's okay. We're going to talk about more Overwatch later on. Uh, and then it's time. We've got like two two weeks left of uh, of this season, Halloween. I don't like to go past October 31st with the Halloween shit. Scary starts September 15th at the 30th or 31st, whenever the last day is. I'm fucking done with it, you know what I mean? So, But until then, it's time to turn it up like Leonard Skinner. Baby, all right? 11? Yeah. Spinal and then, uh, Spinal Tap. Spinal Tap, 211. Oh, yeah, that's good. Uh, and it's time to go hard with some scary games. We'll do Overwatch 2 on its regular days, and then all my other streams will be scary games. So I'm planning on doing some Back for Blood. I hit up uh, Ray. Ray has that. Um, Jeff has that. Dakota has that. So I'm trying to see a good day where we can all hop on, even if it's just, you know, if Jeff catches two hours here, and then Ray hits up an hour or something. See if we get the boys together. I know Colin has it too. That's a good one. Evil Dead, I think I have it. Dakota and Ray has it. So that would be a fun one too. I want to get us all doing some Evil Dead, which I didn't really get into that much when it came out. I wanted to. It's just other shit was around. It's a really good game. I had a lot of fun with it. And I think there's some free new shit with it too. Um, Big, huge thing. None of us have. Plan. What? Oh. You have Evil Dead 2? Annabelle has Evil Dead. Nice. Oh, oh you did you Caesar! You got like a four stack right there. Or is it, isn't it three? No, it's And it's one four. demon? Oh, okay. It's just a four, and then you fight bad guys. And the bad, the bad guy team can have three people on his team. Oh, okay. You're like the main bad guy, and then like you have two little goons or something that you can control. Uh, hmm. Left for Dead 2. That's pretty much Back for Blood. That's that's uh that's what Back for Blood yeah. is now. It's upgraded. It's the same studio. It is. It is. Uh, Annabelle. Yeah. Then we'll have to hit you up. We should do a co-stream or something like that, and then uh, get that going. Let's all rip a shot. A shot of had Halloween me, justice. You had me a shot. Did you say justice? That, you I don't know what that man? means really. I don't think <clears throat> shots need justice. You can take shots for justice. Yeah, there you go. Your, justice! Your server at Hooters. Justice, justice! Oh, that's her name? Yep. Yeah, I figured. So justice, my favorite yeah. server at Hooters. Yeah. I remember when I used to go to Hooters a lot. Yeah, and they kicked you when out of your band? When I had a... No, they didn't kick me out back then. I had a six-pack, so they, they allowed me in. Oh, so you got 86 No. No, he was in the army. They, uh, would, uh, they loved me. They, I'd go in and people would buy my dinner and stuff. I was, I was very well loved. Okay, now everyone what hates. Happened? Me, but it wasn't always that way. Lost a six pack. <laughs> yeah. No, 
That's a full you either live cake. long enough to get free meals at Hooters or die John John. <laughs> <laughs> Jay! That's just a full keg. Yeah. Dakota, I thought you had like fucking Halloween shit all, all behind you. I do. You see the are ghost? You, are you blind? Where's your lights at? You got all the lights. I can't even see them. You're, you're streaming not... last night for, for yeah, because that's for fucking a... Halloween time. We're we're this is a normal podcast. And it's sprink. I said I'm it's gonna... crack sprinkled, full of Halloween stuff. Crack and sprinkled in Halloween. Yeah. Actually, I forgot to turn right. the light off last night. He's still going. Holy shit! Damn. Ghost still going. The the ghost fuck, going the hard. Ghost, like I forgot to turn his light off. Oh, here I'll take Colin it. Crawford with the supporter sticker. Collins in Washington D.C. now and sniper training. I'm just kidding. That'd what? be dope. <laughs> Jeff was like, "What?" <laughs> 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 Cheers, everybody. Oh, there's the light. Oh, oh God, God. He's... are you happy now, John? Yeah. I can't get your ass to do anything. Is that better, John? But yours already looks, yours looks like, uh, John, uh, Jeffrey Dahmer's room. So it's it just, has yep. its own vibe. Yeah. Yeah. You can't see the, you can't <laughs> see the barrel, but it's over here. <laughs> I can smell it from here though. Mm -hmm. Just it. cooking some meat. It must have gone bad. <laughs> All right, let's get into this motherfucking shit, dog. Um, oh yeah, big things planned for October, November. I'm still putting them together, but as soon as I have all the information about it's it's going to be about the giveaways and and uh, the charities for November. We're going to be going hard at the end of the year. We always get really hard, and we and we do it at the end of the year. There's one part of the what time is, of the year. What about games? <laughs> <laughs> we won't have time for gaming with all the doing yeah. it hard, yeah. Jeff. That's right. Um... Real cut in the chat. What's everyone's favorite Halloween candy? If you're walking up with a bag, trick or treat, what do you want in it? Chat, let me know. Jeff, let me know. Dakota, you're next. Right now? Or chat. Yeah. What's Reese's. Your favorite Halloween candy? Reese's. Because it has your last name. It has chocolate and peanut butter. I know. It's probably mine too. It's just delicious. It has to be the honestly, if it's gonna be Reese's, it has to be the pumpkin Reese's. It can't be like the normal <clears throat> Reese's. It's got to be like the specific hol holiday ones. If it's just shaped like that, because I don't. They have they have like a lot of pumpkin flavored. No, 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 no. Like the uh, it just, just looks like a pumpkin. Yeah. Okay, yeah, that's fine. They have like I don't know what it is. It's it's like less chocolate to peanut butter, but it still has a perfect combination. But no, I like I'm I like wrong. Snickers. Snickers is bomb. Snickers is good. good. It is. I, I like, uh, um. Ooh, Butterfingers too. Hell yeah. Uh, fuck. What are they? I like Whoppers a lot, but I don't think a lot of people like Whoppers. All right. Let me do a little bit. I can't do a lot. I haven't had a Butterfinger in a long motherfucking time. Yeah, because you can't lay a finger on my Butterfinger. Duh. Yeah. yeah. Kit Kat is, it is. You don't Kit have Butterfingers because you got dick fingers, John. That's why. <laughs> he's you better not lay a he's got finger on my dick fingers. He's got ultimate oh. grip fingers. Yeah. <laughs> Got that show, Kung Fu Grip. Yeah. T -t 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 Trends with b -b -b benefits. Fits, fits, fits. That's right, folks. That's for us, GGS. Keep you out there up to date with all the new current video game and or uh, relevant uh, culture news. Here we go. McDonald's has teased a team up with Overwatch 2. And I can't wait. Uh, here's what I want it to be. I want it to be an adult Happy Meal with a Mercy blow up doll that I can bang. Nope. Did anybody get that? <laughs> Not at McDonald's. Hey, it sounds right. like Burger King thing. Yeah. So you're saying there's a chance. Yeah. <laughs> Is that... uh, have you heard any news of what what they're gonna be doing, Jeff? Have you seen it? That was that was only leaked for Australia, so nothing's confirmed for the U.S. yet. That's in Australia. Those tracer pictures were from Aus Australia. I was wondering what they were going to do if it was going to be like a happy I could settle for Tracer. Watch tour. No, you just get a skin that looks like. You get like... a skin. They <laughs> give you a code. Like Is it a one we already have? Red and yellow <laughs> skin? You already have, the, you already have a skin? Yeah, it looks like an old one that they already came out with a long time ago. Why the fuck? It's a, pur it's a purple skin. It's not even legendary. Annabelle, I've tried to get Adam and Eve to sponsor this, but I keep jerking off as soon as I walk in, and they just aren't pleased with that kind of behavior. <laughs> 
And their entire company is based around that behavior. I don't get it. <laughs> well, if they like other people to do it, but if you do it directly on them at the beginning of the meeting, it, it uh, we don't, I don't want them to sponsor us. Then. Fuck them. <laughs> Uh, Man of Steel 2. We've all been waiting. What are they going to do? Is it going to be Henry Cavill? It is going to be Henry Cavill. Mm -hmm. And to me, this makes me very happy because i that's one of my favorite DC movies of all time, Man of Steel. You guys it's, like it? It's the only one. Yeah, really? Okay. Oh, yeah. yeah, that's a lot. A lot of people say that. I mean, I like I liked them all. Uh, but like, I like Batman vs. Superman and shit like that, but Man of Steel, that was probably one of the best. Jeff, you, you like that one? Yeah, I liked it. I'm glad they're finally doing another one. It took them long enough. Yeah, I know. <laughs> that monster has a John John mask. Yeah, yep, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Is that you trying to go. the mask right now? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like you're hey, an inhaler. Breathing, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this man in a inhaler. The oxygen stat. Also, speaking of DC, which I just saw right before we went live, is, okay, if there's one movie being pumped up everywhere and being fucking just hyped the fuck up, which started scaring me, it is Black Adam. They had troubles, it wasn't this, and they did reshoots, and blah, 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 and The Rock. You know, everybody loves The Rock, but he's sometimes a little too confident and cocky. He was really going hard on this one, even though all this shit was, like, pointing the wrong direction. You think it was Rocky? So, I guess the reviews are out, and it ain't good. <laughs> like, fours and five. One. Huh? I've only seen one. Yeah, well, I see IGNs. Well, that was it. Uh, like, were you expecting this because it's DC at this point? No, I thought it was going to be better, but I I like stuff that IGN doesn't like, so I don't trust critics at all. Oh, I'm not saying I'm not going to watch the fuck out of this movie. I'm just saying, it, to me, when it gets that kind of, it, it's it's like, is it going to be another Shazam? And that makes me sad. No, it's just, it's not going to be, nothing can be worse than Shazam. All right. <laughs> I think Shazam 2 will be better than Shazam 1. I honestly and... do. Better be. Uh, yeah. Oh, look at my evil hair. <laughs> uh, uh, you heard a comment, White Adam. <laughs> well, uh, oh, you know, uh, oh, I, 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 went, I went and saw the movie in theaters. Yeah, uh, I, uh, I didn't, I didn't think it was all that great. But uh, you know, Dwayne the Rock Johnson, he's a good guy. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, I love that character so much. <laughs> Uh, Annabelle likes Black Adam, but doesn't like Dwayne as him. Yeah, I feel like he was just looking for, like, the I, biggest part. I think that, I don't, I, honestly, I feel like I couldn't see anybody else playing him, in my opinion. I mean, maybe Jonathan Dwayne? Majors could could have played him, but he's, like, Black Adam's a big character. He's a big, fucking bulky dude. Yeah. Like, Dwayne's Batista, maybe? Batista could have played him. Could have. But Dwayne's been saying he's wanted to play Black Adam since he was, like, a teenager. Yeah. Like, like before he started wrestling, anything you would see, he's like, he loves the fuck out of Black Adam, and he just wanted yeah. to be him for like. He's a badass oh, character. Like Thirty it, years. It is now, like, like, a, of... I, I, like a passion project for him, I'd say, right? Yeah. Yeah. I choose magic uh, over, ability, over like normal abilities any day. Well, see, Annabelle Zachary Levy is a god, uh, but it's just how they did Shazam. I just, it was, it was literally like big. It was. It's like too much. It's like too much of of like this other story that I've seen, and then they they just forced it uh, real fast, and all the kids are heroes and shit's crazy. That's all right. They it's done. I, I'm I'm ready for Shazam, Shazam too. I think it'll be good. Um, more a on the other on the other side of things, and over at MCU, Sacha Baron Cohen God. has revealed he's joining the MCU as a very important character. Mephisto? Mephisto. Mephisto? Mm -hmm. My fist? Oh! Mephisto. But honestly, Jeff and Dakota, here's what I want. I just want to MCU Borat or Ali G. <laughs> nice! Yeah, I'm a superhero, nice! <laughs> That's what Shazam reminded me of. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> That's what I want him to play. Um... 
Uh, anybody got two hundred dollars in their pocket right now? Yeah. Yeah. I do. And want to spend it on a new PlayStation Five controller? Nope. Nope. Me either. Check this out. New PS Five Dual Sense Edge. It's an edging controller. Oh, nice. Maybe that's why. Oh, is, that, is <laughs> it sponsored by Blink One Eighty Two? Yeah. <laughs> um. It, it's it's two hundred dollars. Why is a controller? Well, that's like the Xbox, uh, the Xbox controller. The uh, that's what, what they're competing. They're competing. Yeah, with, exactly. Yeah. Xbox has had that uh, controller since the the Xbox One, with the triggers on the bottom, and everything, so it gives you more buttons. Yeah. So this one looks like it's just the same design with bigger thumb things. A lot more stuff on the the back end, like the tail. You can customize like all the triggers to do everything you can replace the thumbsticks with other ones and like, all that like crap and taller ones and shit yeah and adjust to uh, say like the dead zones of the analog sticks <laughs> i don't know what those are but mikey says he edge he edge on my driveway every day <laughs> uh i don't i mean 200 dollars. i can't even imagine at like having this controller and then after three months you start to get the sway in the thumb you know and and you're like you know, what? Like there's a, there's a, uh, I believe they give you a 10 year warranty on it or something like that. At least Xbox did. They give you. Oh, they do. They give you a pretty extended warranty. You're gonna spend the money, you get the warranty. It's the only problem. No, I think it comes with it automatically. Uh, yeah, I don't think you pay for it. All right. Uh, I just couldn't imagine smashing a $200 controller. Well, that's your over Crash right Bandicoot. There. But you know what? I can imagine Dragon. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Dragon these nuts. <laughs> yeah, baby. All right, have, has anyone, everyone seen the new Need for Speed trailer? No. Uh, um, it's I don't know. Are you are you guys fans of Need for Speed? I know we're not big race car driving. Gamers. I used to be when I like the first like I don't know like four yeah. were awesome. Yeah, they were pretty dope back in the day. I haven't really touched a driving game. I like playing the cop. That was fun. Oh, we chase them yeah. down. Yeah. So this one, I'll let you guys see it. It's just, they're popping up everywhere. You'll see it. Maybe we can hit on it next time a little bit. But it's like photorealism, but with, uh, like, uh, Spider-Man multi... What is it with the... The, the animated one. Oh, Multiverse? Enter the, Enter the Spider-Verse. Yeah, Spider Enter the Spider-Verse. You know how it has that crazy, like, art? Mm -hmm. so, it, so photorealism... Combined with that art, which you know, it's, you, you're thinking, oh, right, maybe that, that, that doesn't sound too bad. It's, I don't know if it takes away from it or I gotta see some more. So let's say you're like, you jump over a thing, all of a sudden these like flaming wings come off your car that are animated and shit. Which sounds cool, but it also like, I don't know, you're gonna have to see and it. Where does it sound cool? Yeah. <laughs> which, uh, part, which part of that was cool? Uh, John, just, I was like, oh, it had a glider. Dragon. It had a, oh, glider. It had a glider. Okay, cool. Well, yeah. 60 FPS glider. John, 60 FPS and it. glider. Yeah, here you about okay. it. Okay. Leave me alone. He's like, so I forgot to mention every car has a spoiler on it, like a really big one. <laughs> it does. And it's, it's like animated, yeah. too. <laughs> <laughs> it is. The doors open. Uh, yeah. The yeah, suicide yeah. doors will just open, glide. <laughs> That's kind of cool, actually. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, we just made the game better. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Yeah, um, us. Pretty much just Star Fox at that point. Yeah. <laughs> just read your barrel. Just do barrel rolls. Do barrel rolls. You fall out of your car. <laughs> Fuck my um, seatbelt. The new Sonic Frontier comes out for the Dreamcast. <laughs> Hold on. What? What's that? This just in. The new Sonic game is in fact for next gen. Even though the preview they just showed with Sonic fighting an enemy with four pointy arms and a pointy head looked like it was an extra level on Sonic Adventures, are we excited for this? Still, at this point, Dakota. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll wait till I see more. I mean, you know, chances are I'll probably end up buying it just because I am a psychopath. Um, <clears throat> but that fight did look good, but that doesn't mean that's the only fight that was like their best fight to look at. You know, like there's gotta but be. But why would they show that one? You don't show the ass end of your game that you're trying to sell. You highlight the beautiful part. This enemy. Maybe they're focusing on the enemy. Maybe they're scene. focusing on, on Sonic's combat versus the enemy. The enemy's like not it, got much going on. What it showed, it was terrible. Did you see the video? I watched it for it's like a him second. him going around like this. The whole thing. He's terrible. Sonic. He doesn't do anything else. 
He does a Hadouken. He does a fucking punch. He spins in circles he fast. He his way. Uh, Jeff, are you still excited for old Sonic? I'm still, I'm still looking forward to it. I'm excited just because I'm fucking Sonic, okay? And they're going to get my money. They're going to get my money. Sega. But God damn it. You know? No one, no one gets your money without you complaining yeah, severely about a, it first. And then writing 30,000 Twitter posts that yeah. don't need to be written. Yep. What? They needed to yep. be written. Yeah, I have, yeah. And I needed to turn my notifications yeah, off. Yeah, exactly. Because I was going insane. All of all of three people read John twice, Jeff once. Yeah, I love it. Um, <laughs> so the streamer, Arm Armoramp, Amaranth. Is that how you pronounce Am- it? Amaranth. Amaranth has opened up about having a husband who's now been threatening her. She's a big streamer. I just found out about her not too long ago when really I was at Jeff's house. Yeah. We oh yeah, John doesn't watch streamers. That's right. No, I don't. Yeah, we don't. I watch my. I watch us and our friends of us, our supporters and shit. Those are the streamers I like. Okay. If I want to see some fucking titties flopping around in a goddamn shower, I'd take one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she never do, so yep. that's why you never see them. That's why we're not getting more bath water. Um. Uh, this is true. Anyway, so big thing came out. I guess, uh, you know, she, she I don't know if she was hiding. She had a husband or whatever. But it comes out she has a husband who pretty much, like, runs her accounts and shit. Been threatening her, bad stuff. Not good stuff. Um, but with the shock of this news, all the single simps are requesting chargebacks because oh my God. now they just have no chance of ever getting with her. Like Which... they had a chance in the first place. Jesus Christ. <laughs> hey. You never know. <laughs> Which, you know, now there's just no chance because if you can't pay for it, you know. So you're saying she's down to like about a thousand viewers now? No, she probably. Has, I bet turn on right now. She probably has got 16,000 right now at any given moment. But with with that, I just. Yeah, I she's got 20K, it. so. Yeah. 20K? Yeah. Yeah. That's a, it, it had, if anything, it had a, a positive effect on her. Um, oh, she's uh, not but, that here, bad. but here, uh, I just want to come clean with every one of our fans out there. Just so we're a uh, GGS. We're all on the same page. I got to come, come, uh, come clean about our identity. I, John, John am gay with Jeff and Dakota is our natural born son. Jeff had his own reason. And, and, and the stream. And the stream. <laughs> we, cut, we cut this. We cut this. <laughs> I got older than we're, ruined. we're Jeff ruined. Jeff had his ovaries filled full of my hot PP juice, and we made our third member of GGS. And uh, the facade with Carrie and my kids, it's all a hoax. Actually, Paid the actors. real man love is Paid here actors. in GGS. We're sorry for all the lies, and we'll be straight with you, except for when we're being gay. From now on. I hope you still love us. Oh, God. Yeah. <laughs> you ruined everything. I had to come clean with our viewers, Jeff. You ruined it. Now you're gonna send me threatening emails. Yep. Son of a bitch. That's really gonna make you more popular. <laughs> I'm gonna right. go on Twitter right now. Thirty thousand tweets in the next four hours. <laughs> in the next forty minutes, you mean? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, we are talking about Amaram or Amaram mm. or however you. Know. It's we said it right the first time. Amaram. Yeah. There you go. Amaram. Yep. I was at Jeff's house and I was like, "What's them titties just doing in a hot tub?" He's like, "Oh, that's streaming. Yeah, <laughs> that's what streaming is." And yeah. I was like, "She bought that. She owns a hot tub company, like a inflatable hot dog, uh, hot tub company. A hot dog company? <laughs> yeah, dude. I, I inflatable hot dog company. Great. Okay. Let's do it. Can Boo. we invest with her? <laughs> <laughs> I'm here about the inflatable hot dog. Don't ask what she does after that. I know. I know what yeah. I would do." That's on OnlyFans. Yeah. I don't need to know what she'd do with it. I know what I'd do with it. Check my fans, Lee. You'd try to eat it. Yeah. <laughs> this would. doesn't taste like anything like a real hot dog. I'd get drunk and be like, this is the worst tasting hot dog I've ever eaten today. <laughs> this is, still yeah, this it, is worse than AMPM. I still finished it. <laughs> <laughs> I got a hot dog from Sunshine. Don't. Oh, God. Don't you, do, don't you dare ever do it. I could Why see you... the salmonella on the top of it. <laughs> you like that one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was like, I'll just put extra ketchup right there. Can I get two of those, please? 
<laughs> to me, it's not real. I mean, I ate them, you know, because I was hungry. But, mm, nope. You don't want none of that. Just buy a bag of chips and... <laughs> Cheers, everybody! Be done with it. Cheers, thanks for hanging out, chat. Uh, we're almost to the main segment where we're going to talk about Overwatch 2. And then um, turn it over to uh, old Dakota, who's going to do some Valorant with the new hero, or well, agent. Agent, they're called. Secret agent, man. He's not a secret agent. He's a water guy. Yeah. It's funny because we got a new map called Pearl that's all water-based, and now we got a new agent who is a water-based character. Weird. Is that his oh. base? Uh, I don't fucking know, dude. Probably. Like, do they do that? Mm. Like, every character have their own, no. like... You know, like, Street Fighter? Right, it's not that cool. Right? Mm -hmm. They could have very easily, but... Mm-hmm. Uh, Spider-Man 2. Still aimed at 2023, so that's cool. That's going to be a big one for next year. Insomniac just came out with a little something-something. And then, uh, Scorn. Uh, Dakota, have you played this one? Uh, no, I, I watched one of my uh, favorite streamers <clears throat> play it, and I watched it. It just didn't, it didn't look good at all. So it's getting very bad reviews. Uh, it, what was what was bad about it that you saw? Uh, it's very slow. Uh, the combat seemed kind of wonky. Um, I mean, aesthetically looks really cool because it's fucking gory and uh, very fucking like hellish. Hellish, yeah. <clears throat> Other than that, the combat it was really wonky. Like, uh, I watched so I watched lyric. He was like doing some shit, putting things around, moving sh stuff around to like unlock puzzles. Yeah. And it's like <clears throat> there's no like guide, so you have to like you have to just figure it out. If you don't figure oh, it out, okay. it's like it ta it'll take you like an hour to do one puzzle. I'm like, because there's a ball on the side of the floor that you didn't see. Exactly. And, you're supposed to put it in and there's somewhere. so much texture to everything. It's like really, it's like it's easy to miss detail. Oh, uh, okay, okay, all right, all right. Uh, are you gonna try it out? It's it's free on Xbox. Correct, and I'm not gonna try it out. No, you're not gonna. That's a hard pass. Yeah. Damn, I, this one had some like momentum. I wanted to. I wanted to try it out, especially because it was free. But I, I when I watched, and it, it's like, Halloween. Yeah. It was like gonna be like a perfect like Halloween game. But I just, I think I'm not even gonna fucking care about this one. What was the first? And chat, you're included. The first scary game you ever played, Dakota? Uh, probably either the original Silent Hill or the original uh, Resident Evil for PlayStation. Okay. What about you, Jeff? Yep. First, Resident Evil Director's Cut, yep. PS One. PS One. The very first scary game I ever played was Friday the Thirteenth for Nintendo Entertainment System. Mm -hmm. And then, but I don't. I know I played it. I know I had it. I remember very vividly playing it and having it. And it's hard as fuck. Uh, but then the my main one that I remember is yes, with these three, Resident Evil, for PlayStation, just. Just an amazing mm -hmm. little gem. All right, folks. We're here at the main segment. Segment. This weekend over. Yeah, yeah. Those are two separate <laughs> segments. You can't mix them together, John. Mm -hmm. You can. There's a slash there, so it's okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The slash allows mixing of stuff. Click, click it. Mm -hmm. All right, folks. Finally back to a tale. Of yes tomorrow, or yesterday, I don't know. Oh, I not, yeah. October 4th, 2022, 12 p.m., servers went online for Overwatch 2. And it wasn't until October 7th, even on the 8th, that people could still not log in and go straight into the game. From overloaded servers to account merging problems, this has to be one of the worst game releases in history. So let's talk about why bad game releases and Blizzard go hand in hand. But first, let's talk about some of the worst gaming releases in history that we know of. I'll start. We've got Final Fantasy XIV. I remember that sucker came out. It took about two hours, though, to get in. And it was after that, the problem was just getting kicked out. I could get back in pretty, but it was kicked out. It was probably for a half a day of, of that menacing terror. And then I remember the Division Two had a very bad opening so chat and then let, let, let me know if you guys uh have any off the top of your head uh very bad game openings or releases uh, dakota 
what are some that come on uh, on your mind? That, what are, what was, that I want to mind? say Anthem had a bad one. If not, uh, maybe Anthem did it. I'm trying to remember. There's a couple okay. bad ones out there, but uh, I know Destiny. What about you, Jeff? Destiny had one. Are you going to let Dakota finish or we're just going to? Yes, yeah. Oh, I, I was uh, just going to end it, I guess. I am. Oh, well, Destiny no, I was, 2. I was, I was, well, I thought he was thinking. I was going to be like, well, Jeff. Well, yeah, if you, if you, if, go ahead. Destiny 2 had a pretty bad one. Uh, Destiny they, 2. Yeah, like the first initial launch, it was, it was, it took about an hour. I mean, nothing compared to fucking Overwatch 2, but it definitely took like an hour to get through. Elder Scrolls, yeah, online. Yeah, they had a bad one too. Elder Scrolls. Tanner, what up? Jeff, what do you, what do you, what you got? Uh, any, like, World of Warcraft, pretty much every expansion that came out. <laughs> well, it was worse for Burning Crusade and Wrath of Lich King, when the originals, not the classic version. No, it'd be, you'd get your 30,000 man queues and you wouldn't be able to get in when you 30, did. 30,000? Oh my god, why? Tanner yeah. with 100 stars! And they, yeah, you, you wouldn't get to play that whole day. So, uh, nothing new for Blizzard. With everything that happened with this, do you, would you say that this is one of the worst ones of all time, though? A, no. From start to four-day turnaround where people can actually finally start getting into a game? Well, like I said, World of Warcraft, that was, it's been the same since 2008. <laughs> so it's just Blizzard. They're just yeah. never. What? Why? Why? Why aren't they ready? Why? Like, what's wrong? I, 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 I don't know. There's server issue. I don't know. The D the DDoS attacks. Those are real. Those are real and legit. So. Need, yeah, it's legit. I need to downplay those. Shit, who's not ready for it? No, you can't be ready for a DDoS attack. <laughs> oh yeah. Well, when I build GGS's servers. I'm gonna put DDS blockers all around it. Yep, we're Here, gonna get attacked every day. Yep. <clears throat> nope. Let's... I'm gonna announce it to the world and say there's no. I'm gonna announce person it to the world even hack. worse. <laughs> even even worse. Don't DDoS. <laughs> don't us. try to hack us. Don't it's impossible. Us. Instant. Thirty thousand people. Yeah. If you get past our security, I'll give you a hundred grand. Yeah, you know, no one's ever fucked with GoDaddy servers before. Right. <laughs> All right, all right. I, I yeah, whatever, whatever. I'm just saying. I've I've never heard from a game coming out to four days later that you can finally maybe <laughs> when you press I want to play this game. Okay, I'm in. And Blizzard, no Blizzard. That's even like I've said with WoW. They not, most of the time they weren't getting DDoS like Overwatch Two did. It so was just still just taking that long because they had so I, many people were playing it. I can play for three hours the first day of Overwatch Two. So you did. That's right. I wanted to kill you. So it sounds like John's just a bitch. So, you know, <laughs> good thing of having a PC. Yeah. Ooh, <laughs> yeah. Got him. That's weird. Got him. Uh, 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 but here's here's why. Because let's say, let's say there was 10 million fans of Overwatch. Okay. Let's just, let's, I'm just throwing a number out there. Let's say there's 10 million fans of Overwatch going into Overwatch 2 from Overwatch 1. Then they made it free to play. Which is why 25 million players showed up in the first four days. That's why. That was World of Warcraft back in the day, too. Same thing. Yeah, but that wasn't even free to play. I know. <laughs> yeah, they're making 15 bucks off those 20 million people yep. trying to Jesus. log in. Can I have a couple of those dollars? Not. Not a Wait one. a second. Stay with me, folks. Jeff, Dakota, how can we create a game to where it's free, but then everyone has to pay large sums of money to us every month? By learning how to make a game first. Yeah. What? Yeah, that'll, be, that'll be the first step. Yeah. God damn it. Well, we'll circle back to that then. <laughs> Dakota, you should learn how to make a video game. John, hey? you have time on your hands. I have an actual job. Your job oh, is, 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 <laughs> it, 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 is, job. is work. <laughs> how to make internet. When you pay me specifically <laughs> to not work at a job, then we're good. I expect $5,000 a week. You have to pay him to, learn, to make the internet. 
<laughs> I'm not asking much. It's nine thousand dollars. Nine thousand dollars a week, mm-hmm. tax free, cash only. <laughs> Under the table. I ain't telling anybody about this cash. He's like, I could buy you a video game every four months. <laughs> How does that sound? Uh, all right, let's get back to Overwatch Two. Finally, getting in. If you bought the Overwatch pack, you got like twenty two hundred coins for skins and other cosmetics. Three free skins: a diva, Cassidy, seventy six. Um, they're like pirates or some shit. And then the, obviously the diva, like techno one. That's really dope. Uh, and then Kiriko would be unlocked for you, except for in campaign or uh, comp. He's in there now. They she, she's finally unlocked in comp. Today, I think. Yeah. Oh, shit. Okay. Today, she finally did. All right. Um, let's talk. Uh, so, we've all had hands on. Dakota actually played a shit ton of Overwatch 2 the, the past. I would say the most Overwatch he's played in, since I've known him. Um, so, we can all chat about this. Uh, I'm just going to hit on the new, new heroes, and then I'll get you guys' input. So, the three new heroes, for those who didn't touch the beta, if you're coming in fresh off the boat, uh, you're going to have Joker Queen, Sojourn, and Kiriko at your helm. that will be brand new, spanking new. Uh, Joker Queen, tough in your face combat with her own healing tricks, kind of like Roadhog can heal. Um, team boost, like a very small Lucio ult, and then her ult deals bleed and anti-heal to those that it hits. Sojourn is a 76-like character in her mobility. Slide jump is badass. Her railgun takes skill. I would say she's an S-level hero as far as skill needed to play her well. Kiriko, healing type, can teleport through walls to team members and ult. Massively ups your attack speed and cooldowns on move. So, playing them hands-on for the first time with everybody. Jeff, uh, who's your favorite of the new characters? Uh, guess Junker Queen, probably. Junker Queen? Nice. Have you, uh... Have you been doing some tanky tanking? No, no one wants tank. It's all heals. It's scary out there right now. It's awful. And then the heals aren't even heals. Who do you get, Myra, so you can kill everybody? Yeah, everyone. I get, <laughs> I get, I get yelled at if I'm not Moira or Lucio. Really? Yeah. They, they, I, everyone tells me to switch if I play anybody else. Oh shit! It's ridiculous. Because they need, they're like, kill with us, but then you're obviously, I don't know. No, then they I mean, cry that they're not getting heals. I, I heal, I heal more than any Moira I know. Uh, I know, I know. And so, that's well, what I any, say when I. Any Moira I end up queuing with her. It's it's just like Lydia or, or the people that we play with. I'm not, if I'm talking shit about a character, I'm not talking about the people that are actually good with the character and know what to do. This is majority. Um, <laughs> Sean, my favorite of Watch Heroes, Ken. Uh, Sean, that's Street yes. Fighter. Okay. Well, cross, they're crossing over with everything, so who knows what other fucking heroes we're going to get. <laughs> yeah. We're going to uh, get Ronald Dakota. McDonald and shit. Mm-hmm. Dakota, playing, uh, who was your favorite out of the new character? I actually really like Sojourn because uh, I was, because I'm on PC, so using her railgun, I was actually, like, with her ult, I I got some uh, fucking kills. Yeah, that's tough for me to do. I'm going to be straight up. She's a hit scan, so it's going to be harder for you. I know. I'm not. I'm, I'm, wa- I'm want to try to be good at hit scan, but it's like what I would have to put into it. I'm just. I don't know. I don't you know. To, you have to put in a mouse and keyboard. Right. That's true. That's true. Uh. All right. So. Out of the new character realm, I. I mean, they're all awesome in their own way. Kiriko, she is a very heavy healer. Her teamed up with a Lucio, Moira, or she's doing the healing. Moira's doing the killing, or a Mercy. It can really change the whole game. Uh, what do you guys think about this? Dakota, Overwatch 2, play a little bit of Overwatch back in the day. Overwatch 2, what do you think? Uh, for me, it's just Overwatch. So that's why I haven't Nothing really been... Nothing new pl- for you? No, not really. I mean, it's it's, it's just a, it's Overwatch again. It's you know it's, It was fun, mm-hmm. and I'll probably maybe play once or twice again, but yeah. nothing, nothing crazy for me. What's about you, Jeff? I think, Our, every, I think uh, everyone knows I don't. I don't like the second one. So is it I don't like where you are like fuck it? I because I mean, honestly, this GGS Overwatch is a big thing here. People look to Jeff to play Overwatch games. It's just the 
nature of the beast. Are you going to do those games after Halloween? Are you going to just go back to variety streaming? Or, or is, is it like, what level of hatred for Overwatch 2 do you have? I'll probably go back to variety streaming. Okay. I have I wanted to I wanted to try and place competitive for fun and I've I'm going to hit the 20 losses before I hit 7 wins. It's just really fucking ridiculous. I have you doing support? I I hit all and I get support every time. I have probably Gosh, like... 3 support wins and I've probably played 15 games. Hmm. So I have another 5 to lose or 4 to win. I'm going to hit 26 games before I get a rank. Well, here's the best part about it, is you'll probably be in Bronze 5, which a lot of people... No, they fixed placed. it, so... Huh? They fixed it. They fixed that. So what do they fix? Oh, where you place your what first they, time. What, what, do they, what do they fix about it? Could you tell me? Uh, more. It's more accurate to where... So everyone plays super low. That's why, why do you, I saw Lydia jumped like... Seven or some shit. Yeah, because she, went from bronze, because, she went from bronze five to silver four because they patched it. So your next one, it overcorrected back to where you should have been originally. So you're saying there's a good chance that if I win these next seven at gold one, I'll be in platinum. Mm -hmm. All right. So even with this news, does it make you want to still try? No. Nope. So games. you're just done with Overwatch. Too different. I'll I'll place, but yeah, I'm, I'm not going to play as much as I did before. He lost a good one here, folks. They lost a good one. Maybe we'll get him back a PBE in a year. I'll play, the, I'll play the PBE when it comes out, for sure. But by then, you'd be so far behind, it wouldn't even fucking matter. You won't be behind PBE. Nothing dropped for PBE, so. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, and I guess the comp would be just totally, like, this is a whole separate thing. Yay! You're going to go. Yeah. Well, matter. I hope they make you come back, because I want to play with you, but. I guess fuck me and everyone here in the community of GGS. I'll have to take on the Overwatch 2 games with everybody. Uh, so, with that said then, we gonna get like Kalista Protocol from you? God of War? What, like, what, what, what do we got coming up from the, the Big Jeff then? I don't want to stream God of War, like I said before. What about Kalisto? Kalisto, I will stream. I'll, I'll probably do the Dead Space remake too. I think that's, that's next year. Uh, January, though, I think. Yeah, yeah. Callisto is December, I think, and Dead Space is January. So I will be doing. I will be doing those two. So yeah, I I remember you said that you want to have some special time with God of War, and I I get that. I do. Like, uh, I I get time. that. Huh? So special. It is very special. <laughs> Jeff plays so with his pants on. Yeah, his pants off. The whole time it makes the specials with dicks out. Though. Need to be it needs to be unrestricted. Yeah. He's got Death Stranding too. There you go. That's the spookiest that's, game of all. Yeah, that's when you get to see see a real life suicide on camera. <laughs> all right, let's talk about comp a little bit. We, we're just hitting it. So, if you're new to the comp game, uh, if you're new to Overwatch two and you're trying to get in comp, you have to win fifty games. Win fifty games or play fifty games. Win, I believe. Win, win. fifty games. In quick play, you are um, you are coming in. You only have like seven characters unlocked, which I didn't even. I thought that was crazy to have a, a whole bunch of. characters. You're literally unlocking these characters as a as a as a new player coming in Overwatch Two. I couldn't believe they did it that way. Crazy, kind of crazy to me, but it is what it is. You can uh, um, there you can play them in in training though. Like everything is unlocked in training. Oh, okay, All right. just in quick play, you're the new players are limited. Okay. And then, uh, do you know, I, I don't know, is it like win a game, unlock a character, <laughs> or like... Uh... Um, oh, I believe they're unlocked uh, through the Battle Pass. Oh, okay. It's just different for new people. Okay. All right. Um, yeah, so ranking is a little off, like Jeff and we were, uh, we were talking about. So I guess that's fixed now. So that'd be good for those who are placing... Uh, I, I want to be, I want to see myself in platinum and that'll make me feel good because I got to do, I've lost a lot on tank. <laughs> I keep losing on tank because that is just a sweaty fucking fuck brawl. Fuck fest. Um, the only thing I would like more for the comp is I want to see more of our stats of what we're doing because obviously Jeff and Dakota, they're using our stats 
now, Jeff, you said more than ever because they fixed it on how to level up. I want to see those stats. Like, what are they using to judge us? You know what I mean? Kind of a little breakdown. You win. You you did this damage or something like that. Like a little bit more information instead of just you win seven. Here you go. Or you lose 20. Here you go. Would there be a way? I don't think they've ever given out the exact details for that. They have said it was it's based mostly on your personal performance, which is why you could before you could lose every game and still be close to where you were. What if you if lose you a lot but you have a really good attitude? Is that okay? Is that a a participation badge? Yeah, do I get the you know uh, yeah. It's called endorsements. <laughs> Oh, you, yeah, tried. That you tried. Is. Yep. Still bronze five though. <laughs> yeah. Have you done any comp, Dakota? I played. Uh, yeah, the first day I played three games of comp. Oh shit! You were doing comp on the first day. Mm -hmm. That's all you done? Yeah. So you didn't place or anything? No. Okay. No, that's fine. I just I forgot you were doing that right on the first day. Yeah. Fuck. All right. Here's my breakdown. I think at the very least, it's a fun as hell game to play with your friends. I have uh, uh, there's tons of new elements and character moves to familiar yourself with. Um, Team-based strategy fighting is still the best out there, in my opinion. I don't think there is another game that comes close to actually. I mean, I know it might seem like team-based fighting when you play nowadays, because you got two DPS over here, the tank out there, the, uh, the healers trying to heal each other, and then running up here and stuff like that. It's so called I know Valorant. maybe that team. What? It's called Valorant. <laughs> that's team based like to the fullest T it is it is team oh man we actually lost what? him I thought we were doing a whole podcast yeah. without losing him no that's not gonna happen no I, I I thought OG Overwatch 1 was more team based than Valorant hmm. now it's just a free for all and Valorant is far ahead of it I mean yeah you gotta like you gotta communicate you gotta put your abilities like actually use your kit certain ways yeah but uh, yeah in but, overwatch one you weren't getting a 1v6 clutch yeah how many clutches you see in valorant counter-strike so individual skill can outshine sometimes in valorant but i'll tell you guys this and but you won't give it a chance because you won't play comp enough to actually rank up a bit the games are fucking like crazy clown shoes when i was in bronze five it was almost like i was playing quick play I said I played was... like over fifteen games now. Huh? I've said I played like fifteen plus games. I just haven't ranked because I haven't when lost twenty. When you do rank I... up, when you do rank up, the games do get better, Jeff. There's, no, I, I'm not trying to toot Overwatch's horn. Everybody knows I love it, and I'll suck out the tit. But the games I had in Bronze Five, it, it, that going through Bronze, I lost the most games ever, almost right on par with what you're doing. Al although I did end up winning seven before that twenty. Luckily, I thought I didn't know. I didn't know it sometimes. Then silver happened. A little bit better. Still kind of crazy. I've had some of the best games I've ever played in gold on my way to platinum. It does get better. You just got to give it some time. But I know you ain't gonna do that shit. So, whatever. If it, it places does me get better. right at gold and platinum, then I'm playing gold and platinum. Yep. So I'm playing what you're playing. Then if it's if that's what I place. If you, but we don't know what you place because you won't do it. What do you mean I won't do it? I played fucking last night. Like I'm, I'm, I'm trying. I just get mad. I'm losing four games in a well, row. And I, then I, I just asked off. you if you were gonna place. You said no. No, I didn't. I said I, I'll be placing, and that's probably as far as I'll go. I won't oh, keep okay. playing after I place. I, right. I want to see what I place. I want to see what I. So what placed. if you place fucking high gold, and you're like, all right, cool. I didn't know what I placed. <laughs> what if I come over and jerk you off while you're placing high gold? Then I come and go to bed. Naughty, naughty. And then I go to Dakota's house with drive your car. Do this, do the same thing. <laughs> yep. I won't be playing Overwatch, so. No, he's just gonna jerk you off yeah. and go to bed. <laughs> Play whatever you want, buddy. I don't care. <laughs> uh, all right. The, the cool thing is they are gonna have a Halloween event. I think it's October twenty fifth. It drops twenty fourth, twenty fifth. Correct me if I'm wrong, or just don't give a fuck and let the time come and it'll be here. Awesome. Uh, so that is cool. I didn't know if they were gonna do it because obviously they've been going through shit lately. But they will have it. So I will say cheers to Overwatch 2. And may its PVE come sooner than later. <laughs> yeah. Because once that hits, it'll finally be the game that we were expecting. Right now, it's 
it's very they're very relying very heavily on the new people coming in to fill those they've pissed off a lot of the ogs i i know i see it i see what's happening but it's still got elements there that I think that can shine through, and it'll be an awesome, very large game. 25 million players. I mean, there's no way to, to, to say that that's not a big, you know, awesome thing to have. That's like 25 million people coming over to your house, Dakota, to bang you. I don't want any of that. You don't want 25 me's showing up to your house like this? I only want one of you showing up at my house. <laughs> One's too many. Yeah, beard sweating all over my fucking kitchen while I'm fucking <laughs> making food. Fuck that shit. <laughs> I'll suck it. All right, that's it. That's it for this week. That's it. Uh, You're missing one thing. God damn it, Sean. What? My birthday's next week. So we'll talk about it next Tuesday. You know what? Whatever then. <laughs> <laughs> I already have that plan because we're gonna tell everybody about your band and your birthday shenanigans. Yeah, I think, but I, this is what I did want to look at. Uh, I just want to see how many Tuesdays we have left in the in the month. Two, All I right, think, so we right? have. To, oh, just one. So just one next one. week. Twenty fifth. So that'll be our yeah, hardcore yeah. Halloween one. Our Halloween GGS gang bang. I was here for the Duke. See, Ariel's here. Uh, but yes, Duke's birthday coming up on the twenty seventh. Well, right. Well, my You're birthday's the twenty sixth. The B day stream is the twenty seventh. 20, the 20, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Twenty seventh, we'll be having his all day streamathon. With uh, we're gonna play some Gotham Knights. Um, I'm gonna play Batgirl because Ariel both know who, we both know who makes the better Batgirl. Okay. <laughs> uh, <laughs> say Batgirl or Batgirl. Blah. Yeah. Blah. Anyway, and then um, like Dakota said, we might play some other games. People show up or whatever. We'll take it. Take it as I mean, it Call goes, of Duty yeah, comes that'll... out technically that night, right at nine. I mean, I don't know if I'll What's be out, uh, tech Call of Duty. Yeah, I think so. 28. Call of Duty comes out that I'm night. I'm pretty at nine. sure. I mean, it's uh, the 28th is the after. Yeah. Me or John Batgirl? <laughs> is this are we talking body positive Batgirl or? I'm the body positive Batgirl, and she's the real Batgirl that I hang out with, and I, I, the hot dudes bang her, and then I get the leftover sidekicks. Yeah, you're the funny one. Yeah, I'm the, I'm the funny one. The, the funny best friend. Take one for the team. I promised I'm cool! Come on! I think that's called the grenade, right? <laughs> uh, Yeah, that's it for us. Dakota's coming on with some new Valorant. Do you have the new... I do. I've actually played one round of him. Uh, he's pretty fucking cool, actually. Nice. Cool. Uh, We love you guys. Thanks for hanging out with this podcast. We'll be back next Tuesday with our Halloween thing uh we'll get something going and then uh we love you a long time uh, cheers everybody jeff dakota always a pleasure good to see you guys <laughs> ariel everybody in chat you guys have a good one we'll see you in uh dakota stream coming up after this bye, bye.